Greetings and welcome back to Infinite Infotainment. Today we're diving deep into a topic that will surely pique your curiosity and perhaps even change your meal plans. We're exposing the top 10 foods with deadly health risks. Remember, knowledge is power, and being informed is the first step towards a healthier life. So, buckle up and join us as we embark on this enlightening journey, beginning our countdown with the least harmful food on our list. Starting off our countdown at number 10, we have deli meats. Now who doesn't love a good sandwich packed with slices of ham or turkey? But here's the thing, these deli meats are often processed, and that's where the trouble begins. You see, to enhance flavor and extend shelf life, these meats are loaded with sodium and preservatives, such as nitrates and nitrites. While these might make your sandwich taste better, they certainly don't do wonders for your health. Studies have linked the consumption of processed meats to an increased risk of heart disease and certain types of cancer. That's right. That savory slice of ham could be doing more harm than good. The World Health Organization even classifies processed meats as a Group 1 carcinogen, putting them in the same category as asbestos and tobacco. So next time you reach for that sandwich, think twice about what's inside. Moving on to number 9 on our list we have soda. Ah, the sweet fizz of soda, a staple in many diets across the globe. But do you know what's really lurking in your favorite carbonated beverage? Well, it's a cocktail of artificial sweeteners, chemicals, and excessive amounts of sugar, making it a significant contributor to obesity and tooth decay. A single can of soda can contain up to 10 teaspoons of sugar, that's almost twice the recommended daily intake. Over time this can lead to insulin resistance and ultimately type 2 diabetes. Moreover the acid in soda can erode your tooth enamel, leading to cavities and even tooth loss. And let's not forget about the artificial colors and flavors, which have their own set of health concerns. So, it's high time we rethink our beverage choices. Consider swapping that soda for a healthier beverage next time you're thirsty. At number 8, we have margarine. Margarine has long been favored as a healthier alternative to butter, but is it really? Let's dig deeper. The main concern with margarine is its high content of trans fats. These are industrially produced fats that increase bad cholesterol levels and lower good cholesterol levels. The result? A significantly increased risk of heart disease. But it doesn't stop there. Some studies suggest that consuming margarine may also contribute to inflammation and insulin resistance. That's right, it's not just about the heart. It's about your overall health. What's more, many types of margarine contain emulsifiers and artificial colors, which some people may be sensitive or allergic to. So, while margarine may seem like a good choice because it's low in saturated fats, it's not that simple. The presence of trans fats, artificial ingredients and potential allergens makes it a less than ideal choice for your health. Remember, not all fats are created equal. Coming in at number 7 we have microwave popcorn. Now we're not here to ruin your movie nights but it's important to know what you're munching on. Microwave popcorn is undeniably convenient but it comes with a side of health risks you might not be aware of. One of these risks is a lung disease called bronchiolitis obliterans, also known as popcorn lung. It's linked to the inhalation of diacetyl, a buttery flavoring used in many microwave popcorn brands. This chemical, when heated and inhaled, can cause serious damage to the small airways in your lungs. But wait, there's more. The bags that microwave popcorn comes in are often lined with a substance called perfluorooctanoic acid, or PFOA. This chemical when heated can leach into your popcorn and has been linked to several health issues including kidney and testicular cancer. So next time you want a snack consider popping your own corn. It's a healthier and just as delicious alternative. At number 6, we have fast food. Now we all know how easy it is to give in to the allure of that quick convenient bite. But let's delve into what exactly we're signing up for. Fast food is notorious for its high calorie content, packed with unhealthy fats and sugars. This sets the stage for obesity, a condition that brings along a slew of health complications such as heart disease and diabetes. And let's not forget about cholesterol. Fast food is a major contributor to high cholesterol levels, increasing the risk of heart disease and stroke. Even if you're young, don't think you're immune. High cholesterol doesn't discriminate based on age. And speaking of heart disease, fast food's high sodium content can lead to hypertension, a leading cause of heart disease. It's a trifecta of health risks. Obesity, high cholesterol, and heart disease. So, consider this next time you're tempted by the convenience of fast food. Cracking into our top 5 we have canned foods. Now canned foods might seem like a convenient and budget-friendly option, but they come with a hidden health risk, exposure to bisphenol A or BPA. 
This chemical is used in the lining of many canned goods to prevent corrosion and contamination. However, research suggests that BPA can seep into the food, and when consumed, it may lead to health complications such as heart disease, diabetes, and obesity. Even more worryingly, it's not just adults at risk. Children whose bodies are still developing can be particularly sensitive to the effects of BPA. And let's not forget, canned foods are often high in sodium, and lack the nutritional value of their fresh or frozen counterparts. So, before you reach for that can opener, remember the potential health risks lurking inside. The convenience may be tempting, but your health is worth more. So, try to opt for fresh or frozen foods whenever possible. At number 4 we have processed baked goods. Now who doesn't like a quick donut or a slice of that ready-made cake? But do you know what's in them? The answer, a cocktail of artificial ingredients, unhealthy fats, and an overload of sugar. These goodies, while seducing your taste buds, are not so good for your health. They can increase the risk of heart disease. How? Well, they're packed with trans fats which raise your bad cholesterol levels and lower the good ones. Not a good trade-off, right? They also contribute to high blood sugar levels, leading to an increased risk of type 2 diabetes. The high sugar content can cause spikes in your blood glucose, and over time this can lead to insulin resistance. So, the next time you're tempted by that shiny, sugar-glazed pastry in the store, think twice. It might taste heavenly, but the health consequences can be less so. Remember, just because it's sweet doesn't mean it's good for you. Swimming into the number 3 spot, we have farmed salmon. Now, you might be thinking, salmon? But it's filled with omega-3 fatty acids, right? Yes, salmon is indeed a source of these healthy fats. However, not all salmon are created equal. Farmed salmon in particular is a different story. These fish are often raised in crowded conditions, leading to an increased risk of disease and the use of antibiotics. But that's not all. Farmed salmon are also exposed to contaminants like polychlorinated biphenyls, or PCBs, which have been linked to a range of health problems, including cancer and immune system issues. Moreover, the diet of farmed salmon is different from their wild counterparts, leading to a higher fat content and lower amounts of beneficial omega-3 fatty acids. So, while salmon can be a healthy choice, it's essential to know its source. So try to opt for wild-caught fish whenever possible. At number 2 we have diet foods. You might be thinking, wait, aren't diet foods supposed to be healthy? That's what the labels want you to believe. But often, these so-called diet foods are loaded with artificial sweeteners and preservatives to compensate for the lack of natural sugars and fats. The problem? These ingredients can potentially lead to increased risk of metabolic syndrome, a cluster of conditions that elevate your risk for heart disease, stroke, and type 2 diabetes. In fact, research suggests that artificial sweeteners could even mess with your body's ability to regulate glucose, leading to higher blood sugar levels. Not to mention, diet foods are typically low in fiber and protein, two key nutrients that help you feel full and satisfied, so, you end up eating more, not less. In conclusion, the world of diet foods can be a deceptive one. It's always crucial to read labels carefully and understand what you're actually consuming. Remember, not all diet foods are as healthy as they seem. And finally, the most harmful food on our list, processed meats. These food items, which include favorites like bacon, sausage, hot dogs, and deli meats, carry an alarming load of health risks. Why? Let's dive in. Processed meats are usually high in sodium and fats, and they often contain nitrates and nitrites as preservatives. While these chemicals keep the meats looking fresh and appealing, they can cause serious health problems. Consuming high amounts of these meats can lead to an increase in the risk of heart disease due to the high sodium and fat content. Moreover, a report from the World Health Organization classifies processed meats as a Group 1 carcinogen. That's the same group that includes tobacco smoking and asbestos. This means there's strong evidence that processed meats can cause certain types of cancer, particularly colorectal cancer. So, consider this next time you're thinking about that bacon or sausage. That concludes our countdown of the top 10 foods with deadly health risks. We've dived deep into the world of everyday foods uncovering some unsettling truths. From the sodium-packed deli meats to the sugar-laden sodas, the trans-fat-filled margarine to the potentially harmful microwave popcorn, we've exposed the unpalatable realities of fast food, the hidden dangers in canned foods, and the unhealthy ingredients lurking in processed baked goods. We've also shed light on the potential risks of farmed salmon, the misleading nature of diet foods, and the health hazards of processed meats. What's clear is that we need to be more mindful of what we put into our bodies. Health is not just about exercise and regular checkups, it's also about making smart food choices, 
choosing whole natural foods over processed ones, and being aware of the possible risks associated with some of our favorite snacks and meals. Remember, knowledge is power. The more informed we are about what we eat, the better we can protect our health and well-being. So let's take the revelations from this video and use them to make healthier decisions in our daily lives. If you found this video informative, please like, share, and comment below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos. Here at Infinite Infotainment, your health is our priority. Until next time, stay informed and stay healthy.